Hi, I'm Nicole Scott from Mobile Geeks, and today I'm going to be taking a look at the D-Watch. This is an imitation Apple Watch. Now before you ask, well, why would you buy that, let me demonstrate. Excuse me, sir, is that an Apple Watch? Well, yes it is. Oh, can I buy this gentleman a drink? <laughs> The Apple D Watch looks very similar to an Apple Watch, except for a few key things like the specifications. It's got a 0.95 inch display with a resolution of 96194, 32 megabytes of RAM and 32 megabytes of ROM. It's running an MTK 6260A and an 11.3 millimeters thick. It's got a 180 milliampere battery, and while its functionality is kind of different, so taking a look at the hardware, it does look like an Apple Watch. It has the same strap. Uh, clearly the display is significantly smaller. So you can see there where uh, this is just a black and white display. So let's open up this very lovely box. Here we've got the watch. And then we've got some foam. Here's this snazzy charger. It fits onto the watch like that and then we have an instruction manual which if I'm being very honest with you I did have to read it comes in Chinese and then this side is English the phone itself actually has uh, several language settings but let's just boot it up we've only got two buttons wow super loud so the speaker for that is right over here so if you want to mute that you can actually kind of put your finger over it so this only has uh, two buttons i've connected this to my xperia z3 it connects by bluetooth um, this crown here doesn't turn um, the way that you navigate through this watch is this turns the display on and off and then this button if you hold it down will take you through the foot hold it down again phone book so this is loading everyone in my phone book hit that to go back go through call history I mean it's actually picking up the information off of my how did that go okay oh uh, yeah you hold down to enter it's not exactly very intuitive <laughs> I can't get the remote camera to work uh, I've installed a Bluetooth notifier but it won't do anything messaging so you can see my inbox Still need Bluetooth notifier, and I tried two actually, two different notifiers. Like maybe if you really want this to get going, you can find one that actually works. Uh, searching for new devices, I was really surprised that um, I was having trouble picking up the Z3. It was choosing one of our laptops over the Z3 for a long time, uh, but then eventually I got the Z3 to charge. It's a bit of in the ass, but uh, eventually it worked. Pedometer can't say that I've tested that heavily. Sleep monitor, so, yeah, also can't say that I've tested that heavily. Settings. Clearly the D-Watch isn't a functionality powerhouse, so the only reason to buy a fake Apple Watch must be because you can't afford the real deal and you think owning an Apple product will make you lucky in love. I'm Nicole Scott from Mobile Geeks, who today finds fiction more entertaining than reality. Bye.